70 residents of war and the surrounding areas turned up to the opening of the public inquiry. Most residents are strongly opposed to the idea of the industrial wind turbines and eagerly awaited the evidence presented by the guest speakers. The inquiry runs for a week and is a last-ditch attempt to save the surrounding environment. Only five letters out of nearly 2,400 are in favour of the development, and residents have even sent letters to the farmers protesting against their decision to sell off their land. Well, my major concern is that they're claiming to be environmental friendly, and they're destroying more of the environment than they're doing good for. I mean, half the world is starving, and yet they openly come out and destroy productive countryside and destroy environments that have been there for hundreds of years when they could put these things. There's so many places you can put them, on beaches, places like that, where there would not be any great impact on the environment, no pressure on the environment, and yet they're so, I don't know, so hard, they push so hard to put them in these, where do you destroy communities? And not only are they destroying communities, they're destroying the environment they claim to be preserving. Bearstone is a highly productive agricultural area. The land behind me could soon be home to a large wind turbine. Farmers have been offered a substantial amount of money for their land, which has angered local residents. Janine Heath, reporting for Staffordshire News in Bearstone.